making meats and dropping beats. And our, um, our words were uh, rhythm, cooking, and growth. So, the core concept, the uh, elevator pitch, it is an iOS, Android um, mobile game. And it's a rhythm game where the players have to cook food from different cultures while simultaneously growing all of the ingredients for their dishes all to a festive beat. Uh, so gameplay-wise, um, on your phone, the screen would be split down the middle. Um, you'd have a farm end and a kitchen end. Each side has like a varying number of locations you can tap. In this case, uh, three would be like our baseline. Um, and at, these will change slightly depending on the layout of your kitchen or farm, depending on like what sort of dish you're cooking. In the end, your restaurant is given a score of one to five stars. Is that how well you did? So this is just um, a basic layout of how the first level looks. Um, so yeah, so the way we work is, so let's say the left is the cooking and the right is the uh, growing. So you would have um, the buttons in order from top down and then they go in. So you'd start out with, let's say, this guy is growing food, this one is collecting, and this one is shipping it. You'd start out by pressing uh, in order with uh, growing, then it would add the collecting, and then you'd slide it over to the kitchen as shipping it off. Then from there it would be prep, cooking, and then you'd send it to people. So you would slowly add more and the difficulty would increase as you went, and you'd have to just continuously get them in order. Um, the stars would be shown at the top of the screen, right in the center, um, and as like as you let's say miss notes, it, the stars will slowly go down. So you're not actually working up to five stars; you're working from five stars. And based on how well you do, it will either stay there or you'll your restaurant will lose quality. Um, the way you lose points is when, uh, let's say, the grower has grown everything and you haven't hit the button in a while. Eventually, it will start to flash, and so it's like the food is getting. Uh, overgrown, so they like splits, it's not as good. So by not collecting it, it's ruining the quality of the food. So if you collected it but you never touched it, it's sitting there overripening and starting to rot. And if you don't ship it out, they never get food. So you start losing points just from not cooking anything at all. Uh, and that's a presentation. Any questions? Wait, so can you explain the rhythm mechanics? That... Um, it's, it's based on how like you press the buttons. So it would be like grow, grow, collect, grow, grow, collect, ship, grow, grow, collect, ship, cook. And um so grab a wrapper ish or is uh, think more of a one finger death punch. Okay. Depending on if you don't do things in the correct order or even um Simon, if you don't do the things in the correct order at the correct speed and time, you start to uh, lose points and it just doesn't, it just stops working. And, yeah. So it's not totally going to be too like a music? It's, it's, it's not so much to a music as it is the rhythm of how people are synergizing and like be working. Wait a second, you said festive beats. Yeah. Well, the, okay. the music is there, it's just yeah, not it's, it's, to the music. The, ori the original plan, music-wise, is um, you'd be preparing like a variety of different cultural dishes, so your kitchen lab would change depending on, like, say, if you're working with a sushi bar or something like that. Yeah. So we play music related to that culture. And the, the screen would change. So like, in a sushi bar, you wouldn't be working in an all-green garden, and uh, your standard American kitchen, it would be like a fish market and the sushi bar. And depending on how that's set up, the button top, uh, these two would always stay the same, but these ones might change. So like, you have your... Um, Let's say growing, you have your uh, person watering everything, the person collecting the food, and then sending it out. Um, if it was a fish market, you'd have the person feeding the fish, so this might be up higher. The person catching the fish, so it might be down lower, and the fish market is shipping it out. So it would it would change the layout of the buttons. So it's not um, alter uh, completely repetitive. So it's a little different each time you play, and depending on what you cook, it might change things up. And the rhythm really comes from more of just the rhythm of the order of operations in a sense. You can't cook food if you didn't grow it and ship it out yet. So that's more of the rhythm itself, is like you gotta keep this kind of sequence going. Yeah. And then your score is also based on your speed and accuracy for going through this order. Does 
uh, people people don't don't appreciate it when they get served rotten burnt fish. Unless that's the cuisine. Yes. <laughs> Cooking meats and drop. Yeah, so that was the summer. Fresh, 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 f